Hello friends, this is the unboxing of an e-stop T12 L48. That's the model number. I frankly do not know what L stands for. Of course, it's a three octave, uh, 12 hole, uh, 48 reads. Chromatic harmonica from e-stop. I had heard a lot of uh, good reviews of uh, this one. Although the L, as I mentioned, I do not have a clue as to what it stands for. One thing with E-Stop is the description is not consistent across the globe, several websites. I normally have a look at uh, the North American, uh, even some Europe and uh, Indian websites. And E-Stop is never clear, even on their own website. I, it's very uh, hard to make out uh, what the model number refers to. Uh, especially the suffix or the prefix or in between letters, whatever we have. Uh, all I wanted was a cross-tuned uh, uh, chromatic harmonica 12-hole. And they have several actually uh, with the black covers, uh, the silver, chrome-plated and all that. I just took a chance and ordered one. It cost about $80 Canadian. And they do have for about 120, uh, something similar. Uh, but uh, as I mentioned, I just wanted to see how they are. Recently, I had purchased uh, uh, Suzuki harmonicas. I have made a review of that, unboxing of that. So uh, I just received uh, the package in today's uh, mail. Uh, it's from... Uh, UK seller, uh, uh, he he had some pictures that were uh, quite impressive, I would say, because I went more by the pictures than by the model number. And uh, as you can, uh, if you can see, it is uh, 80 uh, Canadian dollars and it uh, arrived today. So, so let me just open this and also uh, quickly uh, Compare it with a Honor, uh, what is that, uh, 270 Deluxe, Chromonica Deluxe 270. I purchased it yesterday because uh, people have been talking quite a bit about it, good reviews, and I believe that's the uh, standard for 12-hole uh, chromatic. Although I never, uh, I had a... <clears throat> I have a, a Larry Adler for many years now. Uh, somehow, uh, I was not comfortable with the mouthpiece. But recently, uh, a professional uh, suggested that I should uh, purchase the 270. It is pretty expensive for what it is. It's a wooden comb. Wooden comb and uh, only good thing is... Uh, there are no rivets now, they use screws. Anyway, this is an unboxing of the e-stop, but I just wanted to uh, mention that uh, here. I'll quickly compare, I'll show you the other one also. Oh, let me just open this. Uh, let me just tilt the camera a little bit. There's no special packing, no bubble wrap, not a box. Uh, essentially, the packing is not really uh, so good. It's uh, from uh, Simpsons uh, guitars. So, uh, packaging is, as you can see, not good. There is no protection for the box at all. Uh, of course, the uh, bag itself is a bubble wrapped bag, I believe. 
yeah bubble wrap but other than that there is no protection let me just keep it aside so this is the box looks like there is no damage to the box this is how it is i would say the packaging is pretty crude and there's a cleaning cloth there is no e stop name on this looks like a generic i guess they can put any name on that well at least they have e stop written on this fortunately uh, it matches the pictures that i had seen essentially i was looking for a round mouthpiece as you can see it's a round mouthpiece with round holes 12 hole and uh, can you see the holes these are cross tuned there's a cross tuned harmonica and uh, there is e stop written on uh, the top uh, cover and yes there is e stop written on this if you can see that uh this is supposed to be a c scale i don't see any scale mentioned here but the mouthpiece looks metallic i'm not sure it does look metallic let me just quickly uh, clean the mouthpiece with uh, alcohol just in case people have touched it and uh, this is uh, fresh water to just making sure so that is cleaned and let me just just quickly dry it up essentially you should be using a lint free uh, cloth anyway so that is it so <clears throat> the the slider appears to be smooth and uh, before i the end plates are pretty uh, thick and uh, even the weight is good there is no model number written on this I don't see the model number, and just in comparison, so here is the Honor two hundred and seventy Chromonica Deluxe. This is a Deluxe. Yesterday I purchased it. Since I uh, I went to the uh, shop showroom, so there is no unboxing for this. Uh, so let me just open this this is how it comes it came with a cloth it came with this small uh, i think whatever instruction sheet and a shining uh, cleaning cloth so here it is in fact i have not used it because uh, i felt uh, since i was practicing uh, on a suzuki chromatics um 16 hole there i feel the holes are a little uh, wider apart but i'm not sure i just want to compare it here uh looks like it's the same uh, the dimensions were almost almost i would say the 270 is a, just a little bit uh, shorter but otherwise the, if you compare the holes here i think they are aligning so essentially it's the same so 
this is the uh, Chromonica uh, 270 Deluxe. Is Honor. So it's a funny taste. <laughs> Let me clean it further. Well, friends, uh, so that's the uh, East Top. Uh, 1248. So the model number is actually T12 L48. So that's about it. Thank you for your time.